Thank you. Like the scouts, I need a few notes. <laughs> there, they won't. All right. Uh, I'm happy to see everybody uh, that came today. I just, I just want to say I, I love my freedoms, and I'd like to thank uh, all the veterans, you know, today and every day for the freedoms that I have. Uh, the scouts have about 20,000 small flags to retire after uh, lunch. I hope they're up for it. Uh, these flags are placed on veterans' graves in local cemeteries. Uh, for Memorial Day. And I started working here about 22 years ago. Uh, I was in my early 20s, and I used to dread Memorial Day because we had to work extra hard to get the cemetery ready for all the visitors. And uh, I was on salary, so it wasn't any overtime for me. Uh, about two weeks before Memorial Day, uh, a bunch of old guys, and take that, you know, <laughs> a bunch of old guys used to come around sticking flags in the ground beside all these monuments that I had to string trim around. And, uh, you know, I don't know, if they, didn't they know how much work they were making for me? You know, I didn't get it. I was thinking more of myself than others. Uh, but over the years, I started helping them to find the graves and working with them. And, you know, these guys became my friends. And friends like, I'll never forget, uh, Joe Broderick, Larry Steer, Gene Tinnery, and Vinnie Gustafson, just a few of my friends that I met along the way. I started uh, showing them and the flags the respect that they deserved. And I viewed placing flags on Memorial Day as a privilege. In June, after Father's Day, we pick up all the flags in the cemetery. This time the flags are a little weathered. Sometimes the wooden stock gets, gets a little warped and the flag starts touching the ground. So we pick them up and we store them in a dry place out of the elements. And we used to retire these uh, flags in June by burning them. You know, we, we'd uh, break up some sticks, cut up some pallets of wood, probably a half a gallon of gas, too. Don't try that at home. We're, we're professionals. And no accelerants for these guys here, the scouts. But since the smoke could be seen out on the parkway, someone would call the police. That happened a couple of times. Police, and then they would call the fire, and the fire trucks would come. So I figured, you know, why not wait until uh, winter, right? Big snowstorm. You know, nobody would see the smoke then. So that's what we've been doing for the last 10 years. You know, many, many cemeteries, businesses, and people who fly the American flag have limited ways to retire the torn and tattered flags. And I believe that this, this annual ceremony is the most dignified and respectable way that our community can retire the American flag. I'd like to thank each and every one of you for coming today. It shows that you care, and you really care. On regard, attention. On regard, approach the fire. On regard, retire the colors. Let red stand for courage and sacrifices made by the men and women who serve and protect our freedoms. Let white stand for purity, innocence, and liberty that we all fight for. Let blue stand for the sky above us, under which we all must live together. Please join us for a few moments of silence to reflect on what this day means to each of us. Please welcome members of Girl Scout Troops 75075, 74525, and 7989, 79889, who will present thank you gifts to Boston Police, Boston Fire, Boston EMS, and Alan McKinnon.
At this time, uh, we would like to ask West Roxbury VFW Post 2902, the Boy Scouts and the Girl Scouts, to raise two new flags on our flagpole. Flag poles. Color Guard Post. Color! Color Guard, prepare to raise the colors. Color Guard, raise the colors. Color Guard dismissed. Please join us in the Pledge of Allegiance. United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice to all. In addition to the five flags we have retired, we have collected thousands of flags from local cemeteries as well as countless individuals and organizations who have given us their old and worn out flags. These flags will be retired by scouts from our area scout troops throughout the rest of the afternoon. Please join me in singing of the national anthem, please. That was wonderful. Did you enjoy that as much as we all did up here? That was really, really nice. Thank you, everybody.